Okay, guys, WLJK back. Um, like I promised, I'm going to turn and show you what my new world looks like. Now, I didn't go outside or anything in the other video, but I'll show you out here real quick. Got a pretty decent sized farm. Got wheat over there. Had wheat over here, but I decided to cut it down. Now, you might be asking, um, how are the crops growing when there's no water here? You know, the the limit's, what, three blocks away from water? show you that in a minute. Um, got melons down here in a row. Um, got pumpkins on the other side. This I'm going to let grow back in, like I said. Got wheat growing up here. Okay, so that's that. Um, got this little area up here. This is my little, I guess you could say fishing pond. <laughs> Um, it's also got, like, if I want to go out, I can turn around and just hop in the boat and ride all the way down there. A little water slide. So, oh, excuse me. It's actually really, I'm, it, I mentioned earlier in the other video, it was like four in the morning when I was recording this one. I'm recording this right after that, so. But, um, I'm not going to explain the mods right now. We'll get to that in the second video. But get the bed, got the furnaces. Now I got two entrances. I got storage and I got mine. Now the mine, actually let's go to storage first. We'll go down here. Now you might sit there and go, hey, this is weird. It's not a, as complicated as the original one that I did. So it's not as bad. Let me do this here real quick. I'm doing that all wrong. Derp. Because I want to put that in that. And then I want to get this and put in there. Okay. Now, without... When you turn on do this, if you have two tracks, in this case I got a booster and a plane, then you got the detector track. The card will hang over just enough to activate it, so that's why I have that. It goes the redstone around to a repeater, of course. And it comes over to the switch, because if I decide to ride up, I just go boom and get off up here. Now, of course, with that, you take that card off the detector path. It just makes it a loop. So if I launch this, it's actually going to go up this way and go boom. So I turn on, put this switch in so that when I launch it, go over here and launch. Swing! And then when I leave, I just flip the switch back. Now that's actually going down. Let me see here, give you an idea. I am at, uh, let's see here, 62. So that's actually going down about 48 blocks, give or take. Um, and if I wanted to, I can ride a minecart down too, but I'll show you this way, because this is my uh, alternate entrance to it. And I got multiple levels. I got this level that actually goes outside. Um, what else do I got down here? I got the upper level where the minecart first comes through. And then you got this level. If I can get out of the stupid thing, there we go. Alright, that's it. I'm having enough trouble with that. There, I'll take that little section out so I can. There. The minecart comes down. And yes, there is a bunch of obsidian here. When I first came down here, um, there was lava here. And. Lava over here. Nope, that's bedrock. There was lava somewhere else. And I turned around, got enough iron, I made a bucket, and I came down. I got enough obsidian there to turn around, make a portal. So, come down here. Now, seeing only one is mainly coming down, I just have it set up that's why I turn on put these inside. So now I can go here. Put that in there if I want to go back. 
the quick way. Put those in the launching areas. Yes, I got Cave Ogre down there. He just sits there and makes noise. But, uh, now you may ask, okay, I got many different branches and whatnot. How do I keep track of which way I'm going? Um, actually, it's quite easy. Um, as I'm going, like, I know this is the main entrance because I made it double wide. So I have three torches here marking that entrance. So, okay, for instance, yeah, we'll use this way. Okay, I'm going down here even though it's a dead end. I go down here. All right, now I noticed there's a block there. So I put a torch. I have the torch facing me in the direction. Okay, if I have to go this way, I have it face me. So I know, okay, if I see a torch like that, I got to go that way to get out. Same with over here. This area is already set up. And be like, okay, there's a torch. You know what? I don't need that one there. There's a torch. I need to go this way. Don't need that one. Torch, go this way. Come here. Look around. Oh, there's a torch. There's three torches. Come back. So I'm using the torches not only to light up the area, but as I almost make a wrong turn, <laughs> but also to find my way. So anyway, as push that back, I must have bumped it when I came down. So I'll sit here and it's like, okay, launch that one. It takes off. Launch that one. That one will take off. Now I'm going to leave my mine cart down here. I'm just going to go up the steps because I turn around just for the steps. I just made a sign and said exit. And then I come down here, be like, hey. There's a sign here that says ladder. So I go this way. There's the ladder. Come up it. And let's see if I can do this. You can see here there's the track going up. It just so happened that the tracks were laying in the correct orientation, uh, the openings and stuff, so I can have the switches work correctly. Otherwise, I'd have to get in the, you know, the NOR gates and the AND gates and all that and da 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 which is what made the other one so complicated. Let's come back here. Come back out. So there. There's the little tour of Grimlock's new world. And as you can see, the next cart that would have came up would have came up here, which would have been me getting out. You know what? I'm going to turn and move that. I'm going to put that on this side now. Because that's not going to interfere with anything. I think, yes, I do. I had enough cobble. And do that. That way it makes a nice platform I can get out. Um, maybe, yeah, we'll keep that like that. But anyway, that's the new tour, guys. Um, let's see if I get attacked going to bed. And when I come back, if I don't get attacked here. Got attacked. It has to be that chimney. Oh no. My fireplace went out. That sucks. I'm gonna get attacked again. Yep. Critical. <laughs> As the orb slowly sneak up on me. But the bad thing is, you do this enough, it ends up being daytime. <laughs> Alright, so that's been four times. I should not be getting attacked again, I don't think. Nope. You know, it's got to be this. And if that's the case, I'm going to get rid of that. Let's do this real quick. I bet you it is this. And I'm just going to put a block there. If I still get attacked, I'm going to be pissed. No, I'm still getting attacked. Alright, I'll have to look into that. And then rebuild my, what you call it. But the nice thing is, I'm turning around and keep gaining experience so it's like a, a monster generator almost but anyway enough of that I got a bunch of 
Oh, I got two. Good. Oh, and the last piece I did not show you guys. The incinerator. I had to put that in. So, this has been WLJK, guys. Hope you like Grimlock's new little world. Um, like I said, unfortunately, the other one got deleted. Which is a shame, because I sort of liked that one. Um, so, yeah. I shall talk to you guys later.